General Hospital spoilers revealed that Jason was presumed dead following the Cassidy Island bunker collapse as soon as actor Steve confirmed leaving the soap. However, GH fans will recall that he has been reported dead many times before but came back alive. In the end, the actor still has no intention of getting a COVID-19 vaccine, even though it is a mandatory condition on Disney's side. Disney is a big company, so all the requirements they set are also somewhat stricter on the actors. So if he still decides not to get vaccinated, it will not be possible to return to the role on the soap. There has been a lot of speculations that the new actor will reprise the role of Jason on General Hospital instead of him. But according to recent shares from Variety, the film's production side has no intention of replacing a new actor for this role, as well as letting Jason return again as before. Regarding the issue of COVID-19 vaccination, actor Steve is not the only case that does not participate because actor Ingo who has been on the show since 1996 as Jax, has also left. His situation hasn't received too much attention. GH fans will remember that the ending for Jax's character is when he tells Carly that he will be returning to Australia in the near future. But in contrast, Jason's ending is extremely attractive after the tense gun battles as well as the tunnel collapse. Everyone believes he is dead and grieving his departure. Right now, things are getting tougher for those who stay. The General Hospital side even brought up a lot of Jason-related images on a Tuesday episode, showing him and Carly how Laura led back to their first day together. Not only that, it was actress Sarah who took on the role of Carly at that time. We all wonder why there aren't any pictures of Sam since she was his very beautiful previous lover. But the screenwriters confirmed soon after that Carly was Jason's true love.